I got this one out of my backyard. That's a pretty one. Thanks, Masetta. Hi, Emily. Hi. Come look at my rock collection. Neat. How many rocks do you have? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. I have ten rocks. Hi, Stephen. Oh, oh, hi. Here, let yeah. me help you. Thanks. Look what I brought. Hats. Oh, I like that. Look at this one. It has a hole in it. <laughs> hey, Barney. How do you like this hat? Hi, everybody. Hello there. So, what have we here? Rocks. Stuffed animals. And hats. Oh, so, that's where I got this hat. <laughs> My stepmother gave them to me. I'm bringing them to show and tell tomorrow. And this one cracks me up. <laughs> now, that's what I call a silly hat. <laughs> oh, a silly hat. A silly hat. I wear it on my head because that's where it's at. And I know it looks as funny as can be. Oh, a silly hat. A silly hat. I wear it on my head because that's where it's at. And I like it because it feels like part of me. It may be too big or it may be too little. It might even have a hole in the middle. And it might be colored red or blue. My silly hat that I had on my head because that's where it's at. They think it was the funniest thing they see. Oh, a silly hat, a silly hat. I wear it on my head because that's where it's at. And I know it looks as funny as can be. A silly hat, a silly hat. I wear it on my head because that's where it's at. And I like it because it feels like part of me. Hey, those are some interesting rocks you have there. They're for show and tell. I look for pretty rocks wherever I go. Oh, what a great idea. I like your stuffed animals too, Jill. Thank you, Barney. Emily, what are you bringing for show and tell? It's a surprise. A surprise? Oh, boy. Okay, here's another one. Where's Chip? I thought he'd be here today. He had a doctor's appointment to see if his foot is well. He might not have to use crutches anymore. Ooh. Wow, that would be great. <laughs> yes, it would. It's not easy to move around on crutches. Hi! Hi, Barney! Hi, 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 BJ! Hi. Oh, what's in your box, BJ? Oh, I can't wait to show you! <laughs> Look, cookie, everybody! <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> That's quite a car collection. They look like lots of fun. Oh, they're really cool. I know how many cars BJ has. Oh, how many, Baby Bob? One, two, three, four blue ones. Mm -hmm. And one, two, three, four red ones. Oh, that's wonderful, Baby Bob. I'm glad you're learning how to count. Oh, I like counting, Barney. <laughs> Playing outside, it's a beautiful day. The sun is shining in a beautiful way. I look down and what do I see? Three little daffodils waving at me. One, two, three. One, two, three. Three little daffodils waving at me. <laughs> They're so pretty, me oh my. But something else just caught my eye. Move a little closer, what do I see? Six little ladybugs smiling at me. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six little ladybugs smiling at me. It's a great day for counting. Come on, let's count. One, two, three. It's a great day for counting. And you can always count on me. Playing outside is so much fun on a beautiful day. What do 
I see? Nine little clouds drifting over me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine little clouds drifting over me. Everybody's running. Where did they go? Do they know something I don't know? Drip, drop, drip. What do I see? Ten little raindrops falling on me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten little raindrops falling on me. It's a great day for counting. A great day to be with friends. It's a great day for counting. And now let's count to ten once again. One, two, three. Let's go to the treehouse and play with these cars. <laughs> Come on, Steven! See how fast you can go! Yeah! Oh, wow. oh, wow. Cool! Whose turn is it now? I think it's my turn. Oh, I like the way you're all taking turns. It makes playing together a lot more fun. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we take turns. Oh, we take turns. When we play with toys. When we play with toys. Cause that's what's right. Cause that's what's right. For girls and boys. For girls and boys. Oh, we take turns when we play with toys. Cause Play with toys. Okay, here we go. Come on. Oh, we take turns. Oh, we take turns. When we play a game. When we play a game. Cause that's a rule. Cause that's a rule. That stays the same. That stays the same. Oh, we take turns when we play a game. Cause that's a rule that stays the same. Oh, we take turns. When we play a game. Come on, see you again. BJ. Me too. They'd be great at show and tell. Oh, yeah, they sure would. Barney, may I please play show and tell too? Oh, of course you may. Yeah. What would you like to bring? Well, um, I don't know. <laughs> hey, 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 everybody. Hi, Scooter. Hey, does somebody need something for show and tell? I do, Scooter. Oh, well, wait right here. Wow. <laughs> what are you doing, Barney? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, there you are. One, two, three treasures. <laughs> oh, they're very nice. Um, thank you, Scooter. Oh, that's very thoughtful of you, Scooter. But I think Baby Bop might want to bring something of her very own. Yes, I do. <laughs> oh, okay, but if you change your mind, just not. <laughs> well, thanks for sharing, Scooter. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Hey, gotta school. Okay. Bye. Bye. Here, don't forget your things. Oh, <laughs> oh my. Oh, it was really nice of Scooter to share his treasures like that. Yeah, yeah. sure was. I like to run and jump and play. There's so many things to do. I like it even better when it's with a friend or two. Sharing together with friends is what I like to do. Sharing together with friends.
you could use some of my hats for show and tell. Or you can have one of my stuffed animals. Ooh. Thank you, but um, I want to bring something of my very own. Oh, it's great that all of you want to help Baby Bob. Sharing is such a wonderful way to be a friend. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hi. I was just climbing a mountain in the Rockies of Colorado. What a view! Wow. <laughs> I didn't know you climbed mountains. Well, I do love a challenge, but I stopped by because I thought I heard someone talking about sharing. Oh, we were, Stella. Oh, that's wonderful. Sharing is so important. In fact, that reminds me of a story. Would you like to hear it? <laughs> I'm going to need some help to tell it. <laughs> okay. This story is called Stone Soup. Once upon a time, there was a tiny village. The people who lived there were very shy. One day, they noticed a traveler coming their way. Look, someone's coming. Quick, let's hide. What a nice village. Just a place to get a bite to eat. No matter how hard he tried, he couldn't find anyone home. Suddenly, he noticed a large stone on the ground near a big pot. This gave him an idea. The traveler boiled some water in the pot. Then, he held up the stone he had found and in a loud voice said, I'm very hungry. I think I'll make some delicious stone soup. Hello, I'm making stone soup. Doesn't it smell wonderful? I don't taste anything. Well, it would taste better if it had a cabbage in it. I have one cabbage. I'll go get it. The woman hurried away to fetch a cabbage from her garden. What are you making? It's called stone soup. I don't taste anything. Well, it would taste a lot better if it had some carrots in it. I have three carrots. I'll go get them. So she left to get some carrots, and a third villager appeared. I heard that you were making stone soup. It doesn't sound very good. Well, that's because it tastes a lot better when it has some potatoes in it. I have five potatoes. And so she ran to get them. Here's one cabbage. Here's one, two, three carrots. And here are five potatoes. One, two, three, four, five. And in no time at all, the soup was ready to serve. I'm glad you like it. I'm going to give you the stone so you can make soup whenever you want to. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. From then on, the villagers made stone soup every week by sharing from their gardens. Of course, the first thing in the pot was always the stone the clever traveler left for them. The end. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sharing helped everyone, and it made the soup taste better, too. <laughs> Otherwise, it would have just been hot water and a big rock. <laughs> That's right, DJ. <laughs> Back to mountain climbing. I was just ten steps from the top. I'd like to go mountain climbing someday. Oh, yes. um, um, you know what? I still need to find something for show and tell. Oh, well, we'll help you look for something, baby Bob. Sure, we will, sissy. Let's look in the classroom for some ideas. I know, Baby Bob. What if you bring your favorite book? Well, I could. Or what if you tell everybody about a game and then teach them how to play it? A game? Oh, could we play Number Limbo? I love that game! Me too! <laughs> yeah. Number Limbo in it! So you can say
See that your foot's better. Yeah. Thanks. I just got back from the doctor today. He said I don't need my crutches anymore, and I can play baseball again soon. Oh, that's great, Chip. Oh, I bet you can hardly wait. <laughs> You're right about that. We've been getting ready for show and tell. Are you ready, Chip? Yes. I'm gonna tell everyone about my foot, and then let them try out my crutches. Neat. <laughs> but right now, I'm on my way to baseball practice. I want to tell all the guys I'll be able to play soon. Cool. Bye, everyone. So Bye. Bye. Bye, Bye, Chip. Bye, Bye, Chip. Bye, Chip. Barney, mm -hmm. I'm ready now. I know what I want to bring to show and tell. Oh, that's great, Baby Pop. Do you want to show us now? Yes, please. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I'd like to tell you about something that I really love. My favorite yellow blankie. <laughs> <laughs> I like my blankie. It's very, very yellow. I like it even better than a bowl of... Jello. When she holds it close, it feels just right. She's 
She likes her yellow blankie in the day and night. I like my yellow blankie in the day and night. And now I do my dance. <laughs> my blankie is so special and very, very yellow. I like to keep it with me when I say hello. When she holds it close, it feels just right. She likes her yellow blankie in the day. something to show us. Thanks, Barney. <laughs> Everyone, I have a surprise for you. Oh, good. <laughs> Miss Ed has been keeping it safe for me. Well, what is that? Well, my mom has been teaching me how to cook. So I bake some cookies for my class tomorrow. Oh. And I made some extra ones for all of you. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. I love cookies. Me too. <laughs> what a super deep duper surprise, Emily. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. You're welcome. Sharing with friends is one of my favorite things, and I love sharing my day with all of you. <laughs> I love you, you love me, we're a happy family. With a great big hug and a kiss from me to you, won't you say you love me too? <laughs> I love you, you love me We're best friends like friends should be With a great big hug and a kiss from me to you Won't you say you love me too? <laughs> uh, these cookies look great! Uh -huh. Thank you, Emily! We gotta go now, sissy. Oh, okay. <laughs> we gotta go eat some cookies. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> <Bye -bye. laughs> I can't wait for show and tell tomorrow. Me either. I hope everyone likes my cookies. And my stuffed animals. Oh, I'm sure they will. <laughs> I guess I better be going. Thanks for everything, Barney. See you later. Bye-bye. 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 And to all my friends, I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never end. Here's what we did today. We learned that counting all sorts of things can be fun. We began counting by looking at Hannah's special collection of rocks. She had ten of them. BJ was so excited to show us his toy cars. There were four red ones and four blue ones. That makes eight cars. Baby Bop wanted to make bubbles. We tried to count them all. <laughs> Look around you and you'll see many things that you can count. Counting can be so much fun. And remember, I love you. <laughs> <laughs>